My name is Nyasha and I'm 18 years old. I've had a lot of things that happened in my life. I never knew my father. He died when I was very little. And when I was in grade 3, my mother passed away. And I had to go and stay with my aunt, her husband and their children. I always felt that they never wanted me around. My aunt and my husband sometimes say bad things about my mother. Same that she's the one who brought HIV into our family and it was her fault that my father died. I don't know what's true, but I loved my mother and it makes me angry when they say these things. My life changed a couple of years ago when I started dating Tendai. He was kind and I thought he really cared about me. He made me feel like I mattered the most. After dating for almost a year, I decided to disclose my status to him. At first he said he loved me and it was okay. But then he went silent. He stopped messaging me and he wouldn't answer my calls. His friends started to ignore me. It wasn't long before I saw him with a new girl, someone who used to be a friend of mine. Then to make things worse, he told, he told others about my status and that they shouldn't date me. I felt so betrayed and angry, like everything was taken away from me. I had trusted him. I got really depressed. I felt so ashamed of who I am, worthless, and like no one would ever want me. All I really wanted is to get married to someone who loves me and to have babies, but that probably won't even happen. I stopped caring, I stopped caring about anything. It seemed like there was no reason to live. I stopped taking my pills because I didn't see the point in staying out in my life. Sometimes I thought about taking the whole bottle of, of, of my pills so that I'll end my life sooner. I lost a lot of weight. I couldn't sleep and stopped getting together with girls who I thought were my friends, but now were gossiping about me. I hated going to school where I had to face people, and, and a lot of days I just stayed at home. Things were bad at home too. My aunt was mad that I, I wasn't doing anything and yelled at me a lot. Patients and kids from the clinic came to visit me at home because I had missed a clinic appointment. At first I told her I didn't want to talk with her, but she kept trying. She kept messaging and stopped by another time. I finally opened up to her about what had happened. She also had a boyfriend who dumped her and could really understand. When I finally told her I had stopped taking my tablets and that I wanted to die, she said she needed to talk with the supervisor, the counselor at the clinic, who I know. After they talked, they referred me to the mental health nurse at the district hospital. I didn't want to talk with someone new and I didn't see how it would help, but patients insisted and went with me. The nurse was very nice and I liked talking with her. It made me feel better. Also, patients kept visiting me at home, talking with me and encouraging me. She got me to see that I hadn't lost anything and I still have a lot to live for. I started taking my pills again. I take them every day now. I think that if I get a chance, I'd like to become a kid too. I'd like to help others, others like the way patients help me.